Has he forgotten what happens when one plays with fire? The week of September 26, the bold and the beautiful traps deacon between a rock and a hard place, Sean Cannon tells Soap Opera Digest. On one hand, he's got Sheila using his hovel as Madwoman Central. On the other, he's got the young and the restless Nikki putting the screws to him for intel on Diane. And on the other other, aren't we out of hands by now? He's got Diane, who will be none too pleased if he gives her archenemy the ammunition to blow her out of the water. Good accomplices are so hard to find. Credit, Howard Wise slash JPI what's a mostly reformed baddie to do? What choice does he have? Nikki isn't in any mood to take I'd love to help you out, but. As an answer. So Deacon admits to the hand that he played in helping Diane fake her death. He really did want to exonerate Nikki, Cannon says, and if there is some piece of evidence that can help Nikki's case, he is willing to give it to her. Deacon may not always play above board, he adds, but I really do believe he's a better man now than he was when he staged Diane's murder. We will not look back on this and laugh one day, bub. Credit, Sean Smith slash JPI which is oh well and good for him, but it's going to be big trouble for Diane. When Nikki leaves LA, she does so armed with exactly the weapon that she needs to make Diane wish that she'd stayed dead. Review Deacon's life story, from remorseless cad to remorseful dad, in the below photo gallery.